Hello y'all, welcome to the SkyBlue Simulations video, SkyBlue here, aka Drew, and for this video, we'll be in the Delta Wing CRJ700 on version 1.3.01 on X-Plane 11. We're going to take a short flight from, well not really short, it's from Evansville, Indiana to Atlanta, Georgia, it's a real world endeavor route, and let's see if uh, we can make it from point A to point B. There is no ATC right now in Evansville, but there will be Memphis ATC and Atlanta ATC, I think we'll be transiting through both of their airspaces. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So non-standard CRG procedures, I'll be using the X, check X checklist file uh, to keep up with the procedures here in CRJ. Let's get started. I'll look them over here. Opened. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't know about that door. Uh, fuel. Fuel to upload is 3150. Okay, 3150. Also, uh, I, want, I want to put the passengers now. While we're here, so let's go ahead and put 68. We're just gonna pretend to preset it, but there's no real passengers yet. Sounds, exchange engines, access switch, that's correct. PFD arrow, yeah, yeah, this is what we're gonna be using. All right. Safety and power on. Yeah, battery first, right? Not the AC switch light. Probes are both off. Hydraulics. Yeah, they're all off. Arm reset. Put this on auto. Put seat belts on off. Emergency lights off right now. Let's uh, get the cabin lights up and the cockpit lights. I do like having this one. There we go. Alright. Spoiler switch. Auto. It's supposed to be an auto. Spoiler switch. Oh, just lever shut off. Flap zero stowed. And we do have to resize these ones. That is so, so bulky. There we go. So, all right, let's put these pages up. You like on correct stat all unlit. One T switches off. APG and switch auto firex. Yeah, special one, detect and test. It's good. Nav light on. Wait, aren't they both off already? Oh, there we go. Put that already. Nav. Then I'll lit. Grab flow. Closed. Turn on the APU later. Landing elev. Make it like. 100 now. Cruise. Condition air. Tested these already. Low windshield. Arm emergency lights. Arm the anti skid. Test. Gear down. 
those levers, flaps. Let's also set the uh, comms so I can do this now. One to two point seven five. Endeavor. Endeavor. There we go. All right. Those wheel steering switch should be off. Oh, I'm sorry. So the, the flow is after the emergency lights, you go down to the sides, flip this off, and then you do this, uh, uh, these tests on the anti skid as well. Sorry about that. Not standard procedures, as you know already. Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> Alright, let's check the hydraulics. Uh, auto, auto, auto. Properly guarded. I did forget to do this, sorry about that. PFD altimeter, second H. And now we can get the uh, radios and nav set up. Uh, while we're here, I want to put the format to plan view, source to FMS1, set the MDA later, and the local Q&H is 2974, so 400, so... I'll put the MDE to 1,200. 210, it seems. 220. There we go. Let's get the lighting out. Sound by altimeter 2974. Okay, now we put the FMS. Right. There we go. Let's put it from this side. Status world explain database check flight plan Evansville Atlanta Ooh what was that pause there sounded like some lag flight number is endeavor forty six eighty one so EDV forty six eighty one Activate that flight plan for now, and then uh, let's get the routing done. Uh, departure will be from runway 18. Flight plan. It'll be direct to Nashville, actually. Just 700 miles away, and then to Noob. And then to I have, and then Matthew. Back to departure arrivals. We're expecting a Chipper One RNAV arrival from the Matthew transition. ILS 26 right from Zelo. Check that flight plan. Check the legs. Okay, discontinuity. I think it's because we haven't uh, activated it yet. There you go, execute. Yeah, there's no. I don't know how to get, put the step again. So. Noob, I have Matthew. Yeah, that's weird. I don't have a step. Unless I'm actually missing something here. Yeah, anyway. B and A, Vector, Chipper. That looks good. 
So while we're here, let's check out the runway heading. Let's say ATC has cleared us to 7,000 initially. Alright, 7,000, runway 18 for departure. That's going to be your runway heading of 184. We'll just maintain the runway heading. One eight four. There is an obstacle uh, departure procedure. None. No. Yeah, it's just gonna be straight out. Okay. So straight out departure. Mm, now we can do the VNAV portion. Uh, VNAV climb is a profile of traditionally a profile of 280 and point 74 yeah 280 is good we're expecting level 39 or 0 oh my god 280 and point 76 Actually, we should just make this 350. Yeah, 390 is too much. Then we'll make this 3 degrees at, at 290. You know, Alright, that looks good. Um, takeoff speeds will be. Uh, well, I have a separate one here. One two one one two one one three three. Reference will be one eighty one. So we'll make this one eighty one then. I mean, I would, I would make it V two, but that would be uh, too much. So I mean, sure, let's climb it V two, but. Uh, then we do have to pitch down. Let's just test this on like flex thrust or something. Because 92% is just too much uh, for what we're about to do, I think. Alright, so that looks good. Let's start that APU. Well, the APU is in byte. Let's uh, get those doors closed. I wonder how long it takes uh, for the AP to get a bite here in the uh, CRJ. Because huh. I think that's just a short time. I'm not too sure. Oh, there we go. AP starts. All right, transponder. We are assuming two thousand. And again, three five zero because yeah, it's just too much. Doors handling. The doors closed. Push back. Yeah, let's concurrent connect back. Back plan. Connect first. Let's just do the PA later. Just a very simple one. Okay, FMS. One, your format will be this one as well. All right, so let's go ahead and do a briefing then. Very short because we don't have much to uh, brief here. If I'm going to be honest with you. So we're departing Evansville Regional Airport, chart 10 92, September 22, effective 8 September, same charts, same charts. We're at the terminal, uh, T runway 1 8. Taxi via Foxtrot Bravo, runway 18, runway heading 184. Just the southbound departure and one way heading, climb to 7000. We'll intercept the course going to Nashville, which is an initial course at this time of 164. So 
maybe heading 1-8. Yeah, 164 for now, but we do we do have to re-intercept that later on. Anyway, um, oh wait, Nashville is over there. Okay, so we do have to uh, get a course of 150 later on, an uh, intercept of 150. Um, take off with packs on radio on, dry one rate computation on um, flaps 8. You have enough stop watch case before the takeoff. If we encounter a problem on departure, climb MSA, diagnose the problem, return back to runway 22. If it's land ASAP red, or if it's urgent, make left out on runway 22, commence emergency landing. So, threats on controlled airport. Increase our visibility by putting the wing lights on, of course, as well as uh, visually separate as required. Um, be on your guard on comms, be vigilant, as well as uh, Carl's check your position on the navigation of the MFD. So if you have nothing to add, then this uh, briefing is complete. I don't have the checklist here. Something's wrong. Hold on, guys. Let me just update my uh, CRJ700 checklist. Yeah, something is wrong. Okay, X checklist reload. There you go, much better. Alright, check from checklist. Uh, audio warning panel check, electrical power panel check, fire test complete, lights check, fuel panel is checked. Leader panel checked, APU on, start panel uh, checked, hydraulic panel checked, ELT switch is armed reset, cabin pressure panel checked, air conditioning panel uh, checked, ice detector test complete, windshield switches, low emergency lights armed, standby compass checked, side control panels checked, RA test complete, CVR test complete, anti skin test complete, mainline gear bay overheat test complete, thrust lever quadrant checked, TCAS test assumed complete, trims. Uh, checked. Lower pedestal check, stall test, assume complete. Acceptance checklist complete. Cockpit preparation checklist, signs on, landing elevation uh, set. Both altim uh, altimeters, QNH uh, 2974 set, anti skid test complete, FMS set, radio navigate set, departure briefing complete, cockpit preparation checklist complete. Four start flow, hydraulics three, low, auto, and on now. Sterile switch on, transponder, yaw damper, mock trim, and yaw damper, push light. So we check for hydraulics, 1000 psi, fuel, as well as the doors, all closed. Pushback engine start, oil crest, uh, let's just do Unicom, 122.8. Right side, clear left side. Evansville traffic advisory, endeavor 4681, COJ700 pushing back from the terminal, facing southwest, planning runway 18 Evansville. Alright, so that means beacon light on, boost pump on, and the graphic output works a little power. Roger. Are we an AP generator? Yes, we are. And packs on four star checklist APU. Uh, APU on, takeoff data set, doors closed and locked. Beacon on, fuel pumps quantity uh, on. 3093 kilograms. Transponder uh, set, parking brake. On four star check is complete. Graphic copy, clear for push. Ground. Confirm push back plan. Yeah, let's just do a 45 degree push to the line. Parking brake off.
Try to push back and clear to start all engines. We'll start both engines, roger that. We'll start the right and then the left engine. Roger. Ignition button. Press on. Start the right engine. M2. No Gen 2 stable. Gen 2 switch on. Starting engine 1. Operation complete. Set part of brakes. Uh, brakes set. Disconnecting to standby. Good start engine one. Shut off. PCC on the switch on. Just auto. FX. Okay. Shut off. Probes now both on. Rudder, flight control, pull left, pull right, neutral clear disconnect, cancels on the right side. How come the door is open? There we go. And the arm is all steering. Thrust reverser switch is both armed. Flaps eight. And also set the trim. Pencils and pens are received. After start check, gen 1 and 2. Uh, on, bleed valves and packs, set and on. Ignition alpha, bravo off. APU off. Probes. Uh, anti ice off. Probes on. Rudder. Check transponder. Check nozzle steering arm. For start, uh, after start check is complete. Flight control check. Full up. Pull down. Neutral. Full left. All right, again, no spoilers. Neutral. The other one, rudder trims are neutral, elevator trims, and uh, flight controls are checked and free. Back to stat. Yeah. There we go, taxi and lineup. Evansville traffic at Denver 4681, taxiing to runway 18 from the terminal via Foxtrot, Bravo, and hold short runway 18, Evansville. Clear right side and clear left side. Taxi lights on. I can break off. Check that out. Why is the AP open? There we go. And let's go for 30% and 1 and 40%. Brakes check. Good. Also, Evansville is uh, 400, so I guess you have to go back 420, actually, 420, nice. Okay, taxi checklist flaps, 8 indicating, flight controls check, trims green and, green, green and 8.3. Wait a minute. The balance. Oh, okay, that's why. So it's 39. And 
Uh, thrust reversers, arm, body surface check, FMS radio tuning. Uh, checked, brake temps, uh, check, taxi check is complete. Left side, clear right side. Let's do a PA, ladies and gentlemen from the flight deck. Here speaking on behalf of the rest of the crew. Uh, welcome to Delta Connection Flight 4681, operated by Endeavor Airlines to Atlanta from Evansville. We'll be taking off in just a few moments once our airborne wheels up. Flight time will just be about 50 minutes, cruising at 35,000 feet. Try to get the seatbelts off as early as possible, but uh, continue to keep your seatbelts on for your safety and safety of others. So sit back, relax, enjoy the rest of the flight, and uh, we'll get back as we get closer into the Atlanta area. Once again, from the flight deck, aboard this Endeavour Airlines flight, welcome aboard, y'all. Cabin crew doors, uh, correction, and seat for takeoff. Alright, here we go. Just keep this down because I do want to access the uh, uh, flight system quickly. To Evansville traffic advisory, Endeavour 4681, taking off runway 18, southbound departure to uh, 7000 initially. Uh, Evansville. Runway 18 confirmed or runway 18 confirmed? It looks like it's, in, it's on the opposite. No. Yeah, that is the opposite side. So landing lights, strobe lights, taxi lights, toga. Whoa, four takeoff checklist. Fuel and cross flow, man and off, ignition, uh, off. Transponder TCAS, on TRA, read, read on terrain display, what the heck is going on? Anti ice wing and cowl uh, off, cast checked and cleared, four takeoff check is complete. 65%. Oh, it's N2. Uh, looks like I have to modify that then. Set power to 85% and let's get going. Stabilize, take off. That's set. Maybe not this check. D1, rotate. Yeah, this thing is fast. Positive plan, gear up. Damn, that's fast. Laps up, speed check, laps up. Unpilot engage. Laps up. Set climb. That's pretty fast for 40. Down still traffic advisor, 4681, airborne, 5,000, 611, 7,000, last call, I can spell, top five point. Make it 1, 6,000. Alright, turn left, uh, 1, 
five zero. Meters up from there. BS, make it uh, probably three thousand. We'll find the two fifty. This is already like seventy percent. Anyway, uh, you guys think this is heavy or it's pretty light though? 80% payload. <laughs> uh, we got accelerated to 280. Two, yeah, 280. Passing one zero thousand, landing lights on. This is so fast, sterile. Auto. Yeah, his messages are cleared. And we do have to set the nav now. Yeah, just make it eighty percent. Are we lagging? Seven two point five. Look at this climb rate. Amazing. Yeah. Oh, it still went right. Okay. It has to re intercept. Okay, Federal 350. Alright, let's see. So, where do we get handed over? Or when do we contact Memphis Center? We do have to uh, tune into 133.65. Stay with you, Alpha. Roger, stand by. That was a smooth uh, departure, I guess. A lot of things to do there. Uh, Memphis Center 24 Sierra. We got complete uh, failure here on the electronics, so we're going to disconnect. Thank you. Thanks. Transition altitude, push standard, and set cross check. Alright, Whiskey Alpha, I'm going to maintain uh, 15,000, and I'll have on check course for you in a moment. 15,000, repeat Whiskey Alpha. Alpha 258, Memphis Center, ID. 258. And uh, November 1202, Mike, your radar contact 63 miles east of Nashville at flight level 280.
Yeah. We're doing... Uh, 258, thank you. Goodness. Um, at the center, welcome. Contact that's approach 125.8. Good night. Over to 25.8 for FedEx 1361. See ya. Yeah, 1984. Descent up pilot discretion. Maintain flight level 240. Report leaving flight level 320. Descent pilot discretion at 240. Report 320. Leaving 1984. The center American 2667 with you flight level 360 about 170 northeast of Nashville. American 2667 at the center, squawk 4571. 4571. What's the first waypoint? We Number 308 whiskey off the climb and maintain flight level 230. Landing west on Chipper. Thirty-five minus thirteen two. American twenty three zero six. Indianapolis Center is offline. Radar search is terminated. Frequency change approved. Six plus. Yeah, twelve fifty nine. Indy is offline. Frequency change approved. Good night. At 259, over to Utah, so 81, 81 to Chipper is in range. Okay, 76, India is offline, frequency change approved. Have a good night. 81. Memphis, hello, FedEx 016, level 400. FedEx uh, 16, Memphis Center, welcome. It's about time for us, isn't it? Memphis Center, low end of 4681, about 70 miles north of Nashville, level 260 to final level 350. Endeavor 4681, at the center of your radar contact, squawk 4560. Squawk 4560, number 4681. Yeah, Memphis Center, Southwest 551, checking in with you, flight level 360, we are 50 miles northeast of Bowling Green. Southwest 551, at the center, squawk 4525. 4525, Southwest 5 North, standby. Okay, 332, descend to pilot's discretion to maintain flight level 240, report leaving flight level 340. Uh, About 10 minutes to Chipper. Tell plus 258, descend to pilot's discretion, maintain flight level 240, report leaving flight level 340. Tell plus 240, we'll report leaving 340, tell plus 258. Center Delta 1322 safely at the gate. Thanks for your help tonight. Signing off. November 308 Whiskey Alpha contact Atlanta Center 132.97. Southwest 2451 contact Atlanta Center 132.97. Contact two zero miles northeast of Bowling Green, flight level three six zero. Southwest five fifty one, Roger. Oh, this thing is an even slower climb rate wow. than the Airbus. I think. <laughs> oh. 
Oh no, so... Got a 1984 cross speaker at and maintain flight level 190 and at speaker you can descend via the Blues 3 arrival. So Chipper is the uh, descent of the South Tender 2974 and Memphis is landing south. Cross speaker at 190. Uh, send via the Blues 3, landing south for United 1984. Jesus Christ. And if we do like 450 on the ground speed, that's about 8 miles a minute, which means 10. Uh, United 1984, in the transition, you can maintain 2 and 9, 0 knots, and then All the right, once you're about 100 miles to... Okay, so 290, then the West for 1984. Once we're at the 180 miles, we can prepare for the arrival. Number 1202, Mike, your lead Myers base, radar service is terminated, frequency change approved. Oh, okay. Number 4681, amend your altitude, maintain flight level 330, that will be your final. Maintain final level 330, and there Okay, minus 2,000, so that's about 7 miles. Seventy-three. So in about 10 more miles, we'll prepare for a top of the correct? Is my map correct though? Oh no, six miles, so... No, 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 no. seven, that's correct. That's correct. Memphis Center, Midwest 2311, flight level 360. Midwest 2311, Memphis Center, welcome. It's a mock point. Memphis Leaving 340 down to 240. 332, thank you. Yeah, 73, that's correct. Correct, 73. We're doing 7 miles. Transition 290 knots, then resume publish speed. Transition, we'll go back to published uh, for United 332. So about, United 332. Eh, about 90 miles. Okay. It would help if I gave you descent via the arrival. You can descend via the Blue 3 arrival landing Sorry. south of the South Cemetery 2974. Descend via the Blue 3 arrival and at the Slender South 332. Southwest 258, descend via the Vans 3 arrival, landing south at the South Cemetery 2974. Hey, Vans 3 landing south at the 2974, Southwest We can prepare for the arrow like 155 track miles. And Memphis Center, Delta 2328, Nashville, Nashville that's like ready distance. Delta 2328, Memphis Center, runway 20 center, taxi via Tango 4, Sierra 7, cross runway 31 at Tango 4. Okay, we're over to 
240, contact Atlanta, 132.907, good night. Good night, Atlanta, 240, Center United 341, uh, flight level 340. 150, let's go ahead and prepare welcome. for the arrivals. So, FMS 1, I'll select level 330. Three we have Memphis, Memphis Center, center level 340, but didn't uh, give it to you. final. Next waypoint, uh, Nashville. Okay, Passing up. over in Perfect. under a minute. Your controls and comms. Well, uh, make the PA later. So, let's get the digital ATIS. For Atlanta, it is running uh, the latest on arrival of information alpha. The ILS approaches runway 26 ray. We're expecting that. We'll check the charts to see if everything is loaded correctly. So, newbie, I have Matthew McGriff, Babe Lemke Chipper, Merch, Hydro. Rain, clouds, rep, Kimmy, Kiwi, Vector. 26 right. And center, Delta 2320. Zilo Haynes, Bamboo, AJ. Delta 2328, turn left heading 110, runway 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, most importantly, it's on my side, 275, 275, okay, uh, AJ, 2700, decision altitude, yeah, make a DH of 200, set, Airport elevation 1026, just run it up to 1000. Uh, 1020. Alright, that's correct. And if we're looking at this correctly, Delta 258, Memphis approach 125.8, good night. Landing over 268. Okay. And 1984, contact Memphis approach 125.8, good night. Flaps 45, VF of 130. Landing distance required is 1,440. No auto brakes, of course. We are not that kind of aircraft, unfortunately. 
two six red pappy three degrees standard taxi route can be Victor Loop, Bravo Victor and Old Short Echo. Thousand four hundred, so let's endeavor to get off Bravo five. Probably left on Charlie. And we'll be requesting ramp five north. Five north. Alright, so we'll go ahead and do an arrival briefing then. The arrival briefing as follows. First of all, information Alpha and Atlantis, current conditions 3003, ILS 26 right expected. River 4681, contact Atlanta 132.9 or 7, good night. 32.9 or 7, River 4681, see ya. So 2328, your radar contact, say altitude. Uh, 4000, Delta <clears throat> So. Let's go ahead and finish off the briefing first. So Atlanta, maybe I have Matthew McGriff, Babe, Lemke, and then Chipper. Right, so good afternoon, Atlanta Center, heading 250, climbing 14,429. Hydro, Rock, uh, yeah, rain, zero, one, Atlanta, climb, maintain, flammable, 34, zero. ILS 26, right, Charlotte, 13, 17, 23, for published, MSA 3,100 from the MSA. Uh, airport. Reference point. Uh, say again, I'm sorry, you cut off. Benzilo Haynes, Bamboo AJ. course heading to Alexandria. And Dallas. Fuel, uh, extra fuel is five uh, minutes. Spot uh, flying briefing. Flaps of uh, 45 final. At VAP by 1,000 feet. Come if they give us a visual, it's uh, 500. Remember 26 short, we're heading 275. Uh, max reversers. Actually, we can do idle reversers. 1658. If we did idle reversers, we can get off at Bravo 5. Yeah, Bravo 5. Line of center, hello, Endeavor 4681, level 330. 4681, Atlanta Center, good evening, squawk 4560. Squawk 4560, Endeavor 460. How come this changes, though? Alright, yes. Okay. So, Bravo 5, it can be the Loop, which is a Victor, then short of Echo. To five north. Otherwise, Bravo five could be left Bravo right on Charlie, right on Echo Fox, right on five north Delta thirty three. So yeah, that's that's an endeavor uh, base. So similar call signs will be on frequency. Um, what else? And so be vigilant on comms. Parallel winning configuration, so make sure to uh, visually separate as required. Single pod operations configure only as required also. That's it, that's our arrival briefing. Not much to 1476 Atlanta Center, climb to maintain, buttable 370. Eleven zero contact approach one three three point four seven. Bye bye. Forty six eighty one to Santa Fonsa's discretion. Maintain for level two four zero. Send pilot's discretion level two four zero no forty six eighty. Two, uh, 
Just wait for a contact me from approach, and uh, you can contact them when you get closer. Just wait for a contact me. We'll be starting our descent down to the landing area. We should be arriving in about uh, 30 minutes. Weather information Atlanta. Got a slight breeze, a pleasant breeze coming from the southeast. Temperatures in about the 60s. And coming from the east, landing west. Appreciate you for choosing Delta Connection, operated by Endeavor Airlines, as their airline choice heading to Atlanta. And uh, weather transiting through our final destination is Atlanta. We wish you a safe, pleasant journey all the same. For more information on the arrival, including a baggage claim and phone connected flights. Uh, just refer to the ground. Seven Delta Juliet Jackson offline for a good change of crew. In the terminal. So either the ground agents on the terminal or uh, kindly uh, look at the flight monitors as well. Uh, for now, sit back, relax, and enjoy the flight. And Ryan, we're going to talk about the bobbin and weaving here uh, for the heading there. Hope to see you get another Delta flight. We went a little bit 20 degrees to the right here. But for now, Roger, see, see ya. ya. Oh, you know, just slowly cruising at 110 knots. Roger, what's your Mach number? I mean, 811 knots, sorry. Uh, you know, just kind of cruising at, you know, uh, let's see here, Mach 0.7? Oh. It's crazy telling you got that. Yeah, it kind of is. I know what that means. We just pulled about 3G, so we're good. Oh, okay. Oh, you did say pilot's discretion, okay. And we can descend at 23, initially. It's 2986 shacks offline, for because it change approved. Change is a group. Thanks for the help. Southwest 2986. Have a good day. Go back, center. Good evening. Delta 56 Look at this 5 degree pitch down okay. By the way, does it also reflect here? It does say ground attitude indicator, so uh, speed. I'm pretty sure 290 was what was, uh, this aircraft was rated for. I mean, typical uh, speed for descent on the transition.
Denver 4681, cross shipper at the main chain, 13000, the line altimeter 3003. Cross shipper at the main chain, 13000, at Denver 4681. 681, it's got a 13000, 13000, ship rolling altimeter 3003. 3003, 13000, and Denver 4681. Atlantis Center, good evening, Allegiant T-16 with you, flight level 370, just coming up on GATS. Allegiant uh, T-16, Atlantis Center, radar contact, Squawk 2422. Squawk 2422 for Allegiant uh, T-16. T-16, can you get a center possible, maintain flight level 240. Shipper. 340 pilots discretion in Allegiant T-16. Two four zero two forty. Two four zero, Mike. My bad. Atlantis Center, American nineteen sixty four, ready to go. We need Center Charlotte. Center Delta ten forty two thirteen point two for fourteen. Now let's see the three. Ten forty two, Atlantis Center, climbing fame, level three five zero. Level three five zero, Delta ten forty two. Can six. Uh, correction, 1964, Atlanta Center, turn right, heading 210, runway center, and clear for takeoff. Heading 210 on departure, and clear for takeoff, American 1964. 300 trees. Twenty thirty eight line of center radar contact fighting three six zero expect one eight left. Zero one Memphis one three three point six five. Memphis one one three three six five. Hey, I'm gonna purchase online. Should take the workload off uh, that guy. Center I Dan, expect one eight left. Yeah, we're descending too fast. Maybe like, like too early on the profile. Twenty thirty eight decent maintain three thousand. Do you have the shell letter port inside? Clear the visual approach, only one eight left, one eight left, clear to land. One zero one, golf, motor, and rear. Heading 69 radar contact 50 to the southeast of the Charlotte Airport, and uh, yeah, expect one left. That's one zero one off November, Atlanta Center, turn right heading two seven zero, runway one eight left, clear for takeoff. Traffic is uh turning base for one eight left. Clear for takeoff one eight left, two seven zero on the heading. Six ninety four minute contact south to clear drive positive. Alright, passing passing four thousand direct bob to nineteen sixty four. 
1964 climbing team, flight level 320 to lead the speed. Deleting the speed up to 320, American 1964. Now we can get something. This in transition level, so Kanish 3003. So Kanish 3003, set prowls check, passing 17,900. Now check no difference. Line up center, citation 3 Tango Whiskey with you, flight level 430. And 3 Tango Whiskey, line up center, I done. Engine 216, descent of all discretion, maintain 11,000, the astral altimeter 3005. Down to 11,000, well, at least at uh, 216, sorry. Heading 150. Engine 3 Tango Whiskey, radar contact 42 to let you follow me. We're welcome aboard. Who else is checking in? with you, I think, 1,000. 9 4 Atlanta Center, radar contact, clear deck to Chiha, climb and maintain, flight level 410. Flight level 4 I'm just your mic is cutting in and out. Land approach, four three two nine. Forty six eighty one approach one three three point four seven. Three three four seven, have a good uh therefore skid one see it. Two eight two forty one Line approach, hello, number 4681, information alpha, 14,400, descending 13,000. Number 4681, line approach, keep moving. Uh, ILS or visual 26 right, whatever you prefer. Visual 26 right, number 4681. Sixty should do. Fifty nine. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> we busted it by just a bit, which should be no problem. Only by a bit. Twelve 
didn't say how fast, so I'll just give you minus 800. That's 1108, three miles from Grumpy, maintain 3000, so establish a clear dial last for 927 on bridge. Maintain 3000 until established, uh, clear for the ILS approach, runway 27 left. This one is 600. Let's see how fast. I don't lag later on. So in Atlanta, there is a downsloping runway. I do have to make a positive. Delta 23, 2939, 4 south taxi. That's 2939, Atlanta approach, taxi 27 right, via Lima, Juliet, Mike, Lima, Juliet. 27 right, Lima, Juliet, Mike, Lima, Charlie. Delta 2939. Let's be honest, though. I don't think... I can read this, so I can tilt this maybe upwards. Good evening, Atlanta. Delta 805, looking to pick up uh, IFR clearance to MCO with information alpha. Delta 805, I think I sent you your PC. If not, uh, let me know, I'll resend it. I'll take a look now, thank you, Delta 805. Delta 44, on football, two center right, clear for takeoff, wind 1606. Football, just right clear for takeoff, uh, number 34. Can you reset that clearance for Delta 805, please? Yep, no problem, Simon. Delta 1108, wind 1606, we're going to 27 left, Clear to land, okay. Delta 27 left. Atlanta departure, Southwest 270, spot 3 north, ready to taxi with November. Delta, or Southwest 270, Atlanta approach, good evening, taxi 26 left via Foxtrot. 26 left via Foxtrot, Southwest 270. Okay, passing 10,000 feet, running lights on, seat belts on. Uh, descent checklist, I did forget to do that. Descent checklist, landing elevation set, fuel check has checked there, landing data set, normal briefing complete, descent checklist complete. Delta 44, landing departure radar contact. Still yeah. lights on as well. Passing to 3,700, that are great for. Delta 44, radar contact 1,400. Set up our check is complete. Delta 
Under 4681, 7 and 10, 39, iron nav to slot, 2 seven right, quick take off. Delta 29, 39, wind 1606, iron nav to slot, 2 seven right, quick take off. Iron nav slot, 2 seven right, quick take off, Delta 29, 39. Delta 11, only test to be in November, Tango, hold short, 2 seven right. November Tango, hold short, G7 right, Delta 1108. Until for a good landing. Dollar 44, contact the line center, 132.97. 32.97, on Dollar 44. Dollar 44, contact the line center, 132.97. Delta 805 is ready to taxi, runway 27 right, with information Alpha. Delta 805, Atlanta, approach taxi 27 right, via mic. To be a mic. Delta 805. First shelter 3,000, 1,600, climb 1,000. 3,000, 1, uh, left pressure for your radar contact, 1, 2, 1, 4,000. 4,000, 3,000, 1. Southwest 3, 270, runway 26 left line, but wait, short delay for traffic off the south side. 26 left line, but wait, Southwest 270. Uh, 3001 contact center 132.97. 3297, good night, Delta 3001. There, 4681, right turn heading 180. Right turn heading uh, 180, there, 4681. Ox 1108, holding short, uh, 27 right at Tango. 1108, cross 27 right at Tango, join Lima to the ramp. Cross 27 right at Tango, join Lima to the ramp, Delta 1108, thank you. Delta 805, just tra verify your transponders on, let's see, please. It's on, uh, Delta 805. Southwest 270, RNAV, uh, Snuffy 26 left, clear for takeoff. RNAV, Snuffy 26 left, clear for takeoff, Southwest 270. Endeavor 4681, turn right, heading 245, join the localizer. We're heading 245, join the localizer. There, 46 I didn't want to advise if you pick up the airport. Uh, we're looking in there, 46 didn't want to advise. Stay at 05, stay at 05, short runway 27 right, ready to depart. Delta 805, Roger, RNAP slow, 27 right, clear for takeoff. RNAP slow, 27 right, clear for takeoff. Delta 805. There, 46 I didn't want to airport site. Air Force 681, thanks. Clear visual approach from 26 right. Clear visual 26 right, Air Force 681. Work one, GSR.
Collapse one, three check, collapse one. We'll back up with ILS, I did forget to brief that. Southwest 2 sending you, my departure rate of contact. Flaps 2, Flaps 8, speed check. Passing 3500, Southwest 270. Southwest 270, Roger, Compton, 14000. Up to 14000, Southwest 270. This approach is 4000. Forty six eighty one 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 six zero six, runway two six right click. Two six right click and forty six eighty one. <laughs> oh my god, look at that crowd Uh, flaps 20, speed check, flaps 20. 4,437, Delta 805. Delta 805, roger, come to 14,000. Up to 14,000, Delta 805. Southwest 270, contact center, 13297. Center, 3297, Southwest 270, have a good one. Stop 30, speed checked, flaps 30. Landing checklist, cabin crew, advised. Signs, all of us submersers, uh, armed, landing gear lever down, flaps 30, indicating landing check is complete. Which is going to be 805, contact the line center, 132.97. Check the line center, 132.97, we'll see you at Delta 805. Check. Stabilized. Disconnecting autopilot.
34681 request to exit a 5 north. Denver 4681, Roger, left turn Bravo. Right turn Bravo 6, cross 26 left straight in the rim 5. Bravo, Bravo 6, cross 26 left straight in rim 5. And Denver 4681, thanks. Up. Hold on. Something is wrong with my uh, controller. Lighting lights off. Strobe lights off for now. Start APU. Okay, strobe lights on again. Oh crap, what's happening? How come my nose milk tailor is... Something is wrong with my nose, I'll tell you. 1.25 G's, I like it. Clear a runway. Strobe lights off. I want to try this park in a Delta 33, so we're going to set that up. Sorry. Okay, ring lights. Okay, gen switch auto as well. Do I have a checklist? APU off transponder. So the project's complete. Up too far. Oh my god, hard to break on. That's all our ground line approach will be closing. No further ATCs available. Monitor your comments at 2.8. Yay, we got ATC. Is the APO on already? No. Oh wait, no, I mean, like, is it? What? I thought I pressed this already. <laughs> Just shut off one engine. There we go. Uh, shut down the other engine, and we're good. Cam Gurdos arrival and cross check. Hold 
open. Alright, there we go. Shut down checklist, chocks and brakes. Uh, brakes set, transponder, standby, electric gen 1 and 2 set. Off, thrust lever shut off, anti ice off, fuel pumps off, idle 3 and 3B pump off, beacon off, nozzle steering switch off. Shut down checklist complete. Alright, that was a good flight. If I uh, do say so myself. So the landing, it was. Uh, again, there's a. <laughs> There is a downslope on the uh, Atlanta runway, so 2071, eh, that's fine for us, I guess. Crossing out 38. But we were pretty stable, to be honest with you guys. So disconnect out the uh, autopilot, disconnect X pilot, and uh, let's go ahead and check this out. One point zero three G's, Volantis says. It keeps going down, oh my gosh. But yeah, we touched down on the uh, the second uh, chalk marks here. There you go. Wow. That was actually pretty decent though. And this is pretty bright, holy crap. This one was pretty good. Ain't gonna lie. But we floated. I don't know if you count that as floating. I do have to uh, see if we have to approach it V ref instead of V up. I mean, we did duck under the glide slope. I mean, not bad. Holy crap. For flaps 30? That's not bad. Yeah, because it goes down. That down slope there is going to kill you. Bad at all. Oh, look, this is for the, um, I guess it's for the escape uh, rope. 
or rather the tie down for the uh, s uh, escape slide rather. Hey, not bad. Uh, again, 1.25, but uh, well, this is 1.0, so you know, I'll just take the 1.0 and run. <laughs> All right, guys, Sky Blue here, K Drew, and uh, I think this is a good flight. Again, I'm not a real world CRJ pilot, so I'm not sure if you know the climbing is just overpowered or whatever. But anyway, this is still an awesome plane. Sky Blue here, K Drew, have a good rest of your day. Now, we're guys in the world, stay safe, stay healthy, peace. Until the next video, next stream, see ya.